Hey, ik heb de Monika, en ik heb Van Olga, en dus heb ik Bella Egypt! Hey there, I'm Michelle, I'm from London, and you are watching Bella Egypt. Hello and welcome to another episode of course, Bella Egito, that was the director and uh, the location manager here with me. I hope you're doing uh, okay today. It's still daytime, still beautiful weather, we're out here on the north coast, not on the Red Sea. And coming up in the next half hour, we're back in the kitchen with Chef Yusuf, not Yasser as I kept calling him, very embarrassing. And we're making crepe Florentine today. And this is stunning. This crepe coming up, people are used to making the crepes um, and just putting a bit of uh, chocolate inside, cheese inside, whatever you like inside. This ends up looking like a lasagna or ca a cannelloni. It's a w wonderful looking. And the chef, what I like about uh, Chef Yusuf, hey, how you doing? Uh, <laughs> chef Yusuf is that he shares his secrets, his simple one. He makes it simple for you and for his staff. Um, after that, we're going to go out at night for the kids club and uh, well actually, yeah mainly at night I believe, hotels now across the world have to cater to families, especially here on the north coast because a lot of Egyptians come out with their family, you have to have a lot of things otherwise they won't bring them here. So we're going to, we have a little fun fair that they have here for the season. Uh, we have a kids club and it was actually really, really cute this time because there are a lot of kids clubs everywhere. This was a cute one and if lucky we'll get to talk to a few of them. Because we're actually, if lucky, I'm playing with you here because I was actually there. We did talk to a few of them. Of course I was dressed different and it was night time but anyway, glad you tuned in to Now TV International. Showtime. On the north coast one more time you all know this man's name chef yes how are you fine thank you nice to meet you yeah nice to see you again yeah. how's your week been very good the food yeah. delivery turned up oh it's good the customers happy yeah very yeah, happy happy, you happy. Say, everybody you happy the room everyone yeah, happy yeah, thank you god i don't know if you recall last week when we were making that delicious burger um i said that this week i would first ask the chef about all the different designs yes uh, first of all how do you how do you um, uh, learn the different designs, and how yes. do you find the people that are good at that kind of thing? Uh, normally, we found there are good people, and we have a lot of people is good. But must be we learn him what we need, uh, and we have we can buy from the market some of knife and fork and some some like small utensils. Yes, we can do like that. The utensils, yeah, this, yes. But, yes. Uh, excuse me one second. Yes. Okay, this is a, a simpler one. There yeah. are very complicated birds yeah. and everything no, else. No, we make it some of plan, yeah. and then we give it to our staff uh, what he will do. We learn him one time, two time, three time, and then we see him. Ah, he then you do. see who's good. Yes, some people exactly. are, are natural. No, some people who don't, uh, who don't do it. Some people like me? For, no, 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 many people who don't do it, but some of people has come very are you good, good of that. Yeah. You good at this? Yeah, yeah. Huh? Yes. You're an artist, I, like my son and my wife, artists. Me, I can't even draw a cat. <laughs> the cat is nosy. It looks like a like a rabbit or. A... Yes. All right. Today it's a, it, it's it's a kind of unusual. We have, I know, crepe Florentine. I want to exp ask the chef. How comes it looks like a great lasagna? Tell yes. me about today's meal. Normally we have crepe. Everybody no can do the crepe in, in 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 the home. Okay. Tell the people. Okay mixture of a good crepe would yes. you Yes. No, just to put the flour, flour and milk and a little bit of salt 
and eggs. What kind yeah, of flower is this? This flower, best? white flower, normal no, white flower. Not self no, 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 normal white flower. White flour, and then we milk, have milk. A little bit of salt and eggs. Salt egg. and eggs. And then we can do it together. Oh. And then we can make the crepe. And it will come like that. It's very easy, you can do it. And crepes are just wonderful. Yes. Because you can put anything. Savory, or you can put cheese, or you can put, yes. you can do anything. Many things, many things. And, I, I, and I then really normally enjoy. when we stuff that, yes. we'll bring it to us here in one tray. And then you can put some of spinach. Yes. The spinach will take saute with salt and pepper. That, and then we put in the crab. It. Yes. And then we have, uh, must be, we have a ricotta cheese. Ricotta. When we don't have or we don't find the ricotta cheese, we can make it with the, uh, normal white cheese but low salt. Okay, okay. Yeah, okay. yeah, because I remember exactly. we used to buy from Sharma Sheikh when I lived in Dahab. Yes. And as an adult, I couldn't eat ricotta because it just. But my child. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Very little salt. Yeah, a little yes. bit of salt, yes. yes. And then we do it like that. Yes. We'll make it like that, you know, when we put this, everything inside like that, and then we can make Spinach it. And yeah, cheese. like that. Okay. And then we put in the blade like that. Must be we have bechamel ah, sauce. Okay, so when, yeah. it's, when it's all done, one, two, three. Yes. We, and then we organize bechamel sauce. Yes. And also the, to yeah, what is, uh, bechamel sauce and, bechamel and sauce. yeah, and tomato sauce. Okay. We put in the blade like that. Some of parmesan cheese on top. Uh, and then we put in salamander. We come gratin or in the oven. Yes. And then we can eat it like that. When you look, she looks like cannelloni, like oh, lasagna. Absolutely, you know, it's, absolutely. it's like that. And you, yes. know, and you know, guys, if you do not have a salamander at home, almost all modern ovens allow you to put the top, the bottom, or both, sir? Yes. And a salamander, exactly. basically, in case you don't know, means yes. the heat is coming from the top. And it, no, it looks delicious, doesn't yeah, it? Yeah, no, no, really, really, it's good. It's good belit and there's no, no cost. That's, all, that's always a yes. plus, huh? Yes, Like we yes. were talking about a few weeks ago <laughs> yeah. about the meatloaf, you know what I mean? Yes. Tell me, in case they don't know, Chef, bechamel yes. is made how? Some people may not know. The bechamel? Yes. Bechamel, this is very easy. Flour. Flour. Little bit of butter. Butter. Yeah, milk. And then you can do it. It's very easy. How easy can it get? Milk, uh, butter, and, and flour. Yes, it's very easy. Uh, and and a, normally, when we would like to more delicious, we uh, put it a little bit inside fresh cream. Ah, fresh, yes, yes, yeah, yes, we yes. come very it's nice taste. Yes, exactly. And of course, if you yeah. ever make uh, la, the lasagna, excuse me, it's, yeah. Uh, uh, yeah. The, the uh, everybody who knows the bechamel, everybody who uh. do it in a home for make uh. it uh, pasta al forno, uh. many things, well, lasagna, you know, cannelloni. Sometimes we have yeah. new people, some people, you know, can't cook. Some people actually watch this and they never want to cook anyway, they just watch, watch yes. us. Yes. Okay, chef, well, thank you very much. Thank you. Uh, it's nice to see yes. a traditional meal made very differently because normally with these you know people have put something in put half and that's what you're used to having just the double and the slice there just, yes just that. it's good i <laughs> it's one thing i was saying to the people that that i like about us together is yes. that uh i always recognize a good chef that he knows his stuff but then he brings things i haven't heard i've been yeah. doing this 20 very years. important for us how to learn the people All right, I made a big mistake a couple of minutes ago, so <laughs> so anyway, to, to do the ending again, yes. I was saying uh, to the sh chef, the no. chef, uh, not Yasser, who's calling him Yasser? It's Yusuf, what's wrong with you? <laughs> yeah. These people, I mean, yeah. they, they yeah. can't remember yeah. anything. Uh, is that you can recognize, for me, a good chef when he starts, he starts having knowledge and it looks good, but it's generous with his ideas and ideas that I haven't heard and I've been doing this 20 years. So I really you. appreciate you being with us Thank and you. bringing fresh ideas to our viewers. Thank you very much. Thank you, buddy. Thank All you. right, that's it. We'll be Thank back you. next week with Chef Yusuf on Bella Egito, Bella Cuisine. Thank you. Back to the studio. Bella Egypt, the number one show on our TV international. 
or at least that's what my my daughter says. So that at least that's one person who thinks that, you know, which is one. Hey, it starts with one, and then people start to talk. Okay, um, I hope you enjoyed that with the chef. Beautiful, unusual, huh? Where you folded it over again, put them on the side, three of them, and added the sauces, the tomato, uh, the bechamel. It was actually a wonderful, wonderful, and and very simple and much quicker because usually cannoli, uh, cannoli, cannelloni, and uh, uh, what's the other flat one? Uh, lasagna takes much longer because you have to uh, uh, cook in the oven. All right, as I told you, um, kids, what I've noticed here a lot about a lot of the parents, uh, people here wake up much later and the kids stay up much later as well, of course. Uh, that's just, it's a cultural thing here. Um, but during the day I've noticed a lot of sunscreen for the children, the parents taking care of the children. Um, I've seen a lot around the place, these sorts, and it's very good for you as a tourist. There are rehydration sorts with orange, me personally, I much prefer the zinc. I think they give it to the orange to make it palatable for more people. It's orangey, you know. But for me, the, the one that's much more effective is the white one with zinc. Doesn't taste as good, but really helps you, especially in this hot weather. All right, let's get on with the show. Kids club, kids doing, kids fun fair, just kids. Hey, chilling out on the beach. Hey buddy, how you doing? Fine, thank you. And you? Well, what, good. What's your name? Kareem. And you explain to me off camera, you are from? Uh, Canada. From Canada and you now live in? I, don't, I live in the United Arab Emirates. Okay, so you're just here on holiday then? Yeah. Um, you come here every uh, summer? Yeah, every summer vacation, see family and friends. You know? Okay, yeah, because I have family in South Summer. Is this the first time here? We can't say the name of the place, by the way. Is it the first time out here in the North Coast? Um, yeah. Yeah. All right. The water's here. I just came back from Qatar, actually. I was there for a year. In, uh, uh, in the Emirates, where you live, um, are there available water sports like they are here? And is the weather good enough to go to the beach like it is here? Um, yeah, there are a lot of water sports, especially in Dubai. Um, but as for the weather, it's really hot over there. So, like, uh, you get a lot of sunburns, of course. <laughs> And yeah, but like generally it's a really good time over there. Because people just fly over. The, I mean, I live in Charm. To come here is like, ah, oh, I just want to stand with the wind, you know, because we don't get it there. Yeah, I know. Yeah, same there. Same there. So what does your family do? I presume your dad works out there. That's why you live. There. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He works there. And yourself, uh, how old are you now? I'm 14 currently. Oh, so there's plenty of time for university. You? <laughs> yeah, exactly. Is there, is there much, because a lot of people really would not know, for a 14-year-old, in the em in the Emirates, is there a lot for you to do? Do you have to live on compounds? I mean, I know each Gulf state's GCC is a little bit different. So for yourself, what is there to do for a 14 year old outside of school? Um, Dubai is the main place, of yeah. course. Uh, you've got plenty of activities, such as uh, there's this place called Bouncer, like trampolines and all that. Yeah. Uh, Dubai Mall, uh, a lot of activity generally. All you can imagine, all, all in Dubai. All inside. How far are you from there then? Uh, I live in a city called Elaine. It's like uh, one hour, one hour and a half drive from there. Ah, so it's nothing then. I remember when we was in Qatar. It's like every time there's a football game, everybody's on a plane. Yeah, exactly. There's no kids at. I was teaching school. There's no kids at school the next day. Yeah. What happened? Oh, Qatar's playing. Blah blah blah. And everybody flew and then came yeah, back the next yeah, day. Yeah, exactly. How long are you here for this holiday? Uh, one month and a week. One month and a week. Yeah. Well, have yourself a great holiday, thank a safe you. holiday, thank you. and uh, you take care. Well, thank you. Thank bye you. bye.
Okay, we're going to have to speak up here. We have with us, what's your name? Noor. And where are you from? Uh, Cairo. Hello, hello, hello. How are you? Sorry, where in Cairo are you from? Rahab. Rahab. Rahab? Oh, wow. Rahab City. Ah, nice place. I have oh, many, many friends there. How old are you now? I'm fine. You're what? I'm fine. No, uh, how no. old? How old? I'm 10 years old. Oh, so I thought five. You're much too big for five. You're fine. Um, okay, uh, what school do you go to in Cairo? American school. Ah, your English is very good. Thank you. So how long are you going to stay here in the, in the North Coast? Two weeks. Two weeks? And what do you do most of the time? Play. Play, eat. Play with my sister and eat. Ooh, where's your sister? Hi, sister. What's her name? Lily. Lily? Hi, Lily. Hi. Are you okay? Yeah. Yes. Okay, see you got on. Okay, how come your parents let you stay out? You always stay out very late? Not a lot. What is your favorite thing to do in uh, Alexandria? Uh, play and uh, I play and uh, go to the beach and pool. Are you a good swimmer? Yes, a little bit. Have you ever gone to Sharm el Sheikh or uh, Hergad? I go a lot. When you go there, do you go snorkeling to see the fish? I go to like a boat and see the fish when I'm sitting. Okay, the one underneath. Have you? I was just in Sharm el Sheikh. Have you ever seen the dolphins there? We were coming back on the boat. We saw maybe 100 dolphins. It was amazing. 100. It was amazing. We got it on video. Okay, uh, how old is your little sister? Seven years old. Seven? Is she a lot of trouble? Is she naughty? Yes. Are you very naughty? Uh, I don't know. Do you have any brothers? I have a big sister. Uh, how old? She's in college. Huh? She's like, um, she's going... Uh, already? No, three years and she'll be in college. Three years in big college. Okay, listen. I hope you're gonna. Are you, have you been on any rides today? Yes. Yeah. Which one is fun? I love the crazy car. The crazy car. And the ballerina. Ballerina and the and crazy the car. Jumper. Oh, the frog jumper. Yes. Okay, so crazy car. I have to try ballerina and the frog jumper. Yes. All right. Thank you. Have a lovely holiday. Okay. Bye. 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 Bye, Lily. North Coast at night, something for the kids to do. Fun park, amusement park, Malahi, either way, the owner is Eamon. How are you? How are you, sir? How are you? Fine. I'm good, good, good. It's beautiful weather it's here, isn't it? Uh, yes, it's, uh, everything in uh, this, uh, in here is very beautiful. Well, you know, I, I came here four or five years ago. Yeah. Very humid, but tonight it's stunning night, beautiful night. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Now this amusement park it belongs to you, right? Yeah, 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 right. yeah, yeah. And, and uh, how long have you had it here? It's five years here. Five years. Five years yes. About uh, for an amusement park like this, about what age group? Which? When you set it up, what age group did you have in mind? Age group in uh, two years and uh, 
big, yeah, yeah, yeah. All, all, all the family. Yes, uh, of course, because the big ones like this, the family can go together. Family, family this is uh, family rides. Right. All these family rides, small and the bigger, and the kid ride, and the uh, machines, old machines. Now, people would wonder, because because of the season out here, it's not like Sharm, of course. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How many months a year do you work? Uh, work in here is in this, uh, in Sahel, uh, maybe three months, uh, three months and a half, uh, maybe. So what do you do with all the equipment after the three months? You take it back to another uh, amusement? Uh, they stay uh, all, all the machines uh, and store in here. They have enough space to store all this? Yeah, still in here. Yeah, yeah, in here. Yeah, yeah, in here. And you also have uh, a few more around Egypt, right? This yeah. is your business? Yes, this is my business. Yes, I have uh, many park in Egypt uh, also, in Gharda'a, in Sharm el-Sheikh, in Cairo. I have in Cairo five uh, park uh, also. Five parks? Five parks park in Cairo, yes. Mabrook, no, congratulations. Thank you. thank you, thank you. Tell me here, um, if, if somebody brings their family here, uh, do they pay for every ride separately or do they get one ticket and they can go on everything? No, no, this, uh, system uh, system uh, uh, card and uh, char charge one, one ticket. Oh, one ticket okay, to charge, one ticket to charge, and uh, this uh, machine's my lands. Uh, oh, the yeah. same as, uh, I can't say the place, but in Nasser City, there's a, yeah. you buy your card, yeah. you charge it, charge when it's empty, yeah. you go fill it up yes. again. Yes, 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 yes. Ah. charge. All ah. these machines are charge. Ah, nice, ah. nice system. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Well, Most of these rides are imported from where? Uh, all the items, Italy, and the Chinese, uh, now Italy, Japan, oh. a different uh, company. Uh, rides, small rides in China and Japan and the big rides uh, from this in uh, Italy. Now people as well who are bringing their family, they'd like to know um, uh, how safe, the, are there good regulations for safety? Yeah, 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 safety is uh, number one safety. Ah. The park safety number one. They want me to swing like a monkey here. <laughs> the email. <laughs> Bella Egypt NTV <laughs> on uh, Bella Egypt NTV at gmail.com. Also down here, can you see it? Can you see it? Bella Egypt on Nile TV for our Facebook page. Um, I didn't have, I only had like two or three. Hello. What a pretty girl. I uh, only had a two or three of you write with a suggestion for my new page about men's liberation. I need more. Two or three is just not enough. Um, please, on Facebook, if you enjoy the show, if you, uh, please uh, like it and share with friends. If you have new ideas for us, a show, we're always willing. This particular trip, there wasn't a whole lot of out and about. promise you, next time we're back in Charm, we're going to head out and do a few more things outside. This time we chilled with the people, with the families, at the beach, by the pool, at night time, and that was our week. And don't forget, by the way, hey, families are going home with all their, what's that, Spider-Man? I tell you, my son now wants to be Spider-Man. It's amazing, the products. He has to have Spider-Man toothpaste. He has to have Spider-Man this, Spider-Man that. And you know, some shops, of course, it's not a lot of money. Some others say, no, we're originals from America and charge you 10 times the price. Anyway, shut up, Ash. It's time to go. Thank you for the crew here in, uh, in the North Coast, just off Alexandria. For the crew in Cairo at Maspero, thank you very much for putting and editing the show. And to you guys, most of all, um, a great big thanks for choosing Naar TV International and Bella Egypt. Be good to one another. Bye-bye.